Hi children. Today we are going to learn the divisibility rule of 6. And also let us, uh, if you are good at uh, understanding this divisibility rule of uh, 6, uh, then also you can uh, know the divisibility rule of 12, 15, 18 and many more. So let us see. Before, just like our channel and subscribe it. Then after, click on the bell icon for the notifications. Let us see what is the divisibility rule for 6. So divisibility rule of 6, uh, here the divisibility rule of 6. So if any number is divisible by any number, any number is divisible by divisible by 2 and 3 then it is then it is divisible by 6 let us see what is the rule then so why do we take only here 2 and 3 why do we take only 2 and 3 then let us see that because when we because when we list the factors like uh, the factors of uh, 6 are 1 2 3 and 6 so in this if you take any two numbers they should be the quotient like uh, it means uh, let's when we before listing out we, we write the factors uh, like this so here 2 and 3 or the sorry this is 1 into 6 and they're here so 2 and 3 2 and 3 are the co primes and as well as they are the factors of 6 so that if it is divisible by both of these numbers then it is divisible by 6 so let's say uh, take some examples here the number is uh, let me take the number that is 34000 568 34568 so here the unit digit is 2 8 so it is divisible by 2 it is divisible by 2 but coming to the divisibility of 3 means uh, you have to add all the digits so 3 plus 4 plus 5 plus 6 plus 8 if you check here then uh, like 3 plus 4 7 7 plus 5 12 12 plus 6 80 uh, 18 plus 8 is 26 which is not multiple of 3 so that 34568 is not divisible by 6 let's take another number then so here i take uh, like 9 crores 49 lakhs Na, 9 crores sorry 90, 94 lakhs sorry 90 one second uh, that is uh, 94 lakhs 94 lakhs 99,254 if you look at this number here so this is 4 so which is divisible by 2 which is divisible by 2 and if I take the numbers like uh, if I check the divisibility of rule for this given number that is 9 plus 4 plus 9 plus 9 plus 2 plus 5 plus 4 if you add all these digits like 9 plus 4 13 13 plus 9 22 22 plus 9 31 31 plus 2 33 33 plus 5 38 38 plus 4 42 then again uh, just add these two digits like 4 plus 2 that is equals to 6 so that 6 is divisible by 3 so that this uh, this number this number is divisible by 2 and this number is divisible by 3 so that it is divisible by 6 very clear so if a number is divisible by 2 and 3 then it is divisible by 6 very simple just write the list the factors and check then just check the co primes and you can check
let us see another room for the another number like 15 yeah before going to learn uh, learn about the 15 divisibility rule of 15 let us see the divisibility rule of 12 here so let's uh, be, uh, to you can uh, easily find out because when I list the factors like uh, 1 into 12 and uh, 2 into 6 that is 2 6 uh, 12 then uh, 3 4 it is 12 in this if you take any pair of numbers like 1 and 12 anyway they are not co prime because uh, when uh, one is to comparing with the co prime we don't take one and here like uh, 2 and 6 so if you take the 2 and 6 uh, these 2 and 6 are not co prime because the common factor is 1 and also you have 2 so that these are not co primes then uh, the left are with the 3 and 4 so 3 and 4 are co primes that means 3 fourths 12 as well as they are co primes so to check any number whether it is divisible by 12 so you have to check with the 3 and 4 so let us test them now let's take uh, any number here so here I take 54,000 sorry right let me take a number here that is uh, 54,828 so 54,828 so as we discussed that if a number is divisible by 3 and 4 so whether this number is divisible by 3 and 4 or not let us see yeah to check with the divisibility of 3 let us add all the digits that is 5 plus 4 plus 8 plus and 2 plus 8 so that is 5 plus 4 9 9 plus 8 17 17 plus 2 19 19 uh, sorry sorry so yeah 5 plus 4 uh, 9 9 plus 8 17 17 plus 2 19 19 plus 8 is 27 yes this number is divisible by 3 yeah this number is divisible by 3 then let us check with a uh, 4 4 means you just take the last two digits that is 28 two digits in the sense units and uh, tens units and tens so here this 28 is a multiple of 4 that means this also divisible by 4 it means with this number that is uh, 54,828 is divisible by 4 and 3 that it is divisible by 12 so let us check another number then so here I take uh, 3 lakhs let me take 3 lakhs 17,436 uh, right so 3 lakh 17436 let me check with the 3 first of all that means sum of the digits adding all the digits 3 plus 1 plus 7 plus 4 plus 3 plus 6 so this is 3 plus 1 for 4 plus 7 11 11 plus 4 15 15 plus 3 18 18 plus 6 is 24 which is a multiple of 3 so that this e number is divisible by 3 then let us check with the 4 then 4 is nothing that taking the units and tens place of a number so that is 36 obviously if it is a multiple of 4 so that it is also divisible by 4 so when it is divisible by 3 and when it is divisible by 4 it means it is also divisible by 12 right so I uh, hope you all understood about the divisibility of 12 let us check. Uh, let us take the number whether uh, divisibility rule of 15 now. Yeah, divisibility rule of 15. So you, here, what you have to do is select first of all uh, just write the factors like 1 into 15. Oops. Let me write the factors of 1 into 15 here. That is 1 into 15, and then after 3 into 5. So in this uh, as we said before 1 and 15 like with one uh, relation we don't take so here 3 and 5 because no more other to be listed here so 3 and 5 are co prime so that if you test with the 3 and 5 then also it is divisible by 15 so let's take any number like that so let me take an uh, like uh, 81,995 here so it is uh, divisible by 15 or not so first of all you have to test with the 3 that is 8 plus 1 plus 9 plus 9 plus 5 
So let's add all these digits like 8 plus 1, 9, 9, uh, 18, 27 plus 5, 32, where 32 is not a multiple of 3. So uh, without testing with another number like 5, we can uh, tell that 81,995 is not divisible by 15 means it has to be divisible by both the numbers it has to be divisible by both the numbers here uh, let's take another number that is uh, 5 lakhs 48,925 let me check it and first of all let us test with the divisibility rule of 3 so divisibility rule of 3 is nothing but sum of the digits that is 5 plus 4 plus 8 plus 9 plus 2 plus 5 so 9 plus 8 17 17 plus 9 26 plus 2 26 plus 2 28 28 plus 5 that is uh, 33 yes it is a multiple of 3 so it is divisible by 3 then you have to check with a uh, 5 so here the 5 means the units digit here the units digit is so we know the divisibility rule of uh, if, it, if it is 0 or 5 then uh, if the unit is 0 or 5 it is divisible by 5 that means this number is divisible by 15. Let us see the divisibility rule of 18 then. What is the divisibility rule of 18? As we knew before for the other numbers like first of all write the factors of 18 here that is 1 into 18 and uh, then it is 2 into 9 and uh, 3 into 6 after writing the factors here that is we don't take 1 and 18 we know that then uh, if you take 2 and 9 here these two numbers are co primes so that if so but here you have 3 and 6 as they are not co primes they are not co primes so here I just take 2 and 9 uh, where the product is 18 and also they are co prime numbers so that if a number is tested with the 2 and 9, then it is divisible by 18. Let us take the numbers then. That is, uh, let me take here a number like uh, 2 lakhs. 2 lakhs. 2 lakhs. 18,682. Uh, 2 lakhs. 18,682. Let me test whether this number is, first of all, you have to test with the, uh, with the 2 here, with the 2. So here, yeah, the unit digit is 2, obviously, because we know the divisibility rule of 2, where if the unit digit is 0 or 2 or 4 or 6 or 8, then it is divisible by 2. So fine, this number is divisible by 2 because the unit digit is 2. Let us take another number, the 9. So just you add like uh, 2 plus 1 plus 8 plus... 6 plus 8 plus 2 because the divisibility rule divisibility rule of 9 is just adding the digits so that 2 plus 1 plus 8 plus 6 plus 8 plus 2 so 2 plus 1 is 3 3 plus 8 is 11 11 plus 6 17 17 plus 8 25 plus 2 is 27 so that this number is multiple of uh, 9 because 27 is divisible by 9 27 is a multiple of 9 so here we can say very clear this number is divisible by 2 and 9 so that it is divisible by 18 you can take any number like this let me take another number here that is 9 lakhs 84,000 let me take 9 lakhs 84,564 yeah so let me, yeah, again here the unit digit is 4, so obviously it is divisible by 2. So then let, uh, for testing with 9, let's add all the digits. So that is 9 plus 8 plus 4 plus 5 plus 6 plus 4. Yes, so 9 plus 8 is 17 plus 421, 26, 32 plus 4 is 36. Yes. So this is a multiple of 9 because 9, 4 is 36 so that this number uh, is also when it is divisible by both the number then obviously like 2 and 9 then obviously it is divisible by 18. So I hope you all understood this and please uh, click on the so before again uh, just like our channel.
like our channel and uh, click on the uh, bell icon and subscribe it for notifications thank you thank you all